Lieutenant James Digby from the Light Dragoons, and I'm a locon here on African Line. Awesome. So my job on African Line, um, I'm a locon commander, so I'm the link between the simulated movements and real troops that we have out on the ground, and the planners who are working hard on the strategic and tactical picture. During African Line, um, we are simulating the movements of the AFRICOM army um, against a near-peer enemy. I'm one of the commanders that are, are moving the simulated units and reporting back what we see on the ground to our planners up in HQ. African Lion is a multinational annual exercise conducted by US AFRICOM. Um, it involves international partners, um, takes place across a few countries, and it's against a near-peer enemy in a fictional scenario where we practice warfighting. So in terms of operability, we've got a British contingent, and we're working to an overall um, US and Moroccan combined task force. Um, that's on a high level, but on a low level, I sit on a desk with an American colonel, a Moroccan colonel, and a few captains of each. Um, I'm interacting with Italians, Dutch, every day. Um, we're getting food together, we're talking together, learning about each other's systems. So both professionally and personally, um, it's all about creating those relationships. African Lion tests our ability uh, to be able to deploy against the kind of enemy that we haven't fought in a while. Um, we always need to be preparing for the worst case scenario. And strategically, um, we are best placed to do that by practicing large scale exercises such as the African Lion. It's a great feeling working aside joint nation partners. Um, I've deployed with Americans before. I've never worked with Moroccans before, or Italians or Dutch. Um, it's something we do every time we deploy, and it's always a good time. We always have a laugh about the different things we eat and the different way we say things, but we always come away with hopefully a few new patches, a few new stories, and um, a good sense of a relationship between the, the nations. I joined the armed forces um, because I was ambitious. I wanted to travel the world. I wanted to make a difference, and I wanted to work with people that I admired. And so far, I've gone to a few places. I've done a few things. There's much more to be done. There's a lot more places I want to go. But that's why I'm in the Army.